okay children the given question in the exercise number 1.3 in the given question direct question so children we should observe in the question when the repeating decimal 0.3636 children are you understand children 0.3636 that, that is the we should learn in the value children don't learn in the 0.36 okay children 0.3636 so on he is written in the simplest fraction form p by q find a sum find a sum p plus q okay children first we should do in the given question in the given question given given 0.3636 so on 36 so on means 36 so on etc children first let the value is x children x the value 0.363636 let the, the the repeating decimal so we should repeating decimal we should stop the children so that the values two values is the repeating value repeating decimal we should stop the only one single value we should put a bar we should put a bar so that is the repeating decimal value. for example children 0 0.36666 only so we should we should consider out put the bar value is one one digit only why because the repeating decimal is the one only so we should write it the six bar only but children we should understand children so what about the bar value so bar value means the repeating decimal so we should consider the period or period city what about the period children so period 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 children that is the repeating decimal that is the repeating decimal so number of four digits in the repeating decimal is called a period children so that is the 36 okay again children periodicity again children periodicity so the how many numbers we should repeating the total numbers or number of digits only children number of digits Number of digits only one, two only children. So the period value is two. Okay, I'll understand children. The period value is that is six. Huh? Number of digits repeating decimals two. Number of digits repeating decimals is called period city. Okay, children. Okay, two. Okay, children. This is the huh? the period city value is two. So we should multiply in the given given question. 100. Why? Because the periodicity value is 2 means 1 double 0 100. Now, for example, in the given question, the periodicity value is 1. We should do multiply in the 10. In the given question, the periodicity value is 3. And we should do in the multiplication for 1000. Okay, children? So, in the given the periodicity is the 2. So, both sides are multiplied. In the given question, children, in the given question means that is the let this is the children children this is the this is the question children so both sides are both sides are multiplied multiplied by 100 why because children so we should we should do who do only 100 value why because so the previous p value is 2 we should do multiplication in the 100 okay children so in the given question 100 into x 100 x Okay, children. So this is the 0 0.36. Again, 36. Again, so on. This is the bar. The uh, uh, left the bar. We should write in the 0 0.36, 36, so on, children. But but we should do multiplication in the hundred, children. First, listen, listen carefully, children. First, we should write and. Uh, yeah. 100 into 0 0.3636 so on children okay children but we should do 100 100 into x 100 x the, the 100 to have to multiply in the decimal value the point move the two d's only why because the 100 value to the two zeros the point make the move in the two digits the, the, the value is 0 0.36.36 Three six so on children. Okay, children. Are you understood? First, we should multiplication. The point move in the two days. Why? Because the, we have to multiply in the hundred hundred number, hundred digits. 
okay in the given same value x is equal x is equal this is the x is equal to 0 children we should the write in the point next to point okay point lecture how many digit children once again listen 0.36 bar means 36 36 36 so on so this is the or of x is equal okay children so point next value point point left side 0 point right side 36 again 36 again 36 we should we should observe the children we should write the point to make the put the value point and point left side make the value for zero and point right side make the value 36 36 36 so on so okay children so this we should do in the subtraction and cancel the values and cancel the values so on etc so the remaining value is the 36 36 is equal to so 100 minus 1 99x okay children so x is equal to 36 by 99 again children we should do cancellation in the right table that is equal to 4 by 11 So children, but what about the pivotal form? So this is the pivotal form. This is the rational. This is the rational number. This is the rational number. Rational number means pivotal form. So we should do. Uh, we should convert in the pivotal form. This is the pivotal form, children. So what about the p value? What about the p value? What about the p value? P value is the four, and q value is the. Q value is eleven. So the given question sum of p plus q. The given question sum of p plus q. P plus q is equal to four plus eleven. That is equal to fifteen. Okay, children. But in the model, in the same question, children. For example, uh, express the. For example, express each of the following decimals. Decimals in the model for same sum, children. Express the. Express the each each of the rational number in the given question zero point three six only. We should do in the three by two form. Again, so children, this is the this is the given in the repeating decimal. We should we we have to put the value for the bar. But this is not the repeating decimal. We have we have not put the not having to put the bar value. So again, this is the very important children. This is also first we should do. Remove the point zero three six by point makes the value point makes the value one and point after digits so we have to convert the zeros point after digits so how many digits two digits so two digits zero zero okay the the answer is thirty six by hundred okay children are you understood again this is the example for the second question one point two five there is no given in the bar value. There is no given in the repeating decimal value. So why do why do in the given question? So again, in the given bar value we should do in the pivotal method. Pivotal form in the in this method. But there is no given in the value. It's one point two five. So again we should convert in the remove the bar, remove the point. So one twenty five bar by point makes the one point. Up is how many degrees? Two degrees. Zero degrees. So the value one twenty by twenty five by hundred. Children, we should do in the cancellation in the same table. So our division or same value in the given left is left in this value same. Okay, children. This is the model for without without bar and this is the model for with the bar. The model for exercise one point three. This is the given sums in the ninth class and our tenth class also given. It's a very interesting children. Now we should understand very very. Thank you.